casual Catherine shopping in a tartan cape as she walked round department store in Windsor. Catherine, the Princess of Wales, was spotted clutching plastic bags filled to the brim as she supported local businesses. At a quaint market town, Catherine was seen this afternoon enjoying a bit of retail therapy in Windsor accompanied by her bodyguard. The Princess of Wales was seen by shoppers holding a few plain blue plastic bags as she shopped in the independent market in Peace, God Street, Windsor Chloe Nelson who co-owns the nearby Nelson's Eye Patch store spotted Prince William's wife as she walked around the high street. The 40-year-old visited department store Antiques Emporium as she prepares for a family holiday season with husband, Prince William and their three children. Catherine looked lovely in a tartan cape as she left the Antiques Emporium and headed up the high street. It's a great ambassador for shopping in local independent shop. On Saturday, Catherine Middleton looked mesmerizing in a promotional picture for Royal Carols together. At Christmas, she wore a stunning floor-length red gown. Catherine was mesmerizing in the photo wearing an intricately embroidered red sequin dress by needle and thread London behind token be seen a fireplace decorated with a festive wreath, a Christmas tree with red, white and golden bows and bobbles and wrapped presents. A firm believer in recycling her clothes. Catherine previously wore it in January 2020 when she co-hosted a reception at the palace with Prince William marking the UK Africa Investment Summit. Catherine looks almost identical two years later to her January 2020 look, the mainland. Perhaps only difference appears to be that her hair has grown significantly longer as for accessories. Catherine stuck with the red theme and went for sorrow jewellery, ruby and gold drop earrings which she also appeared to wear the last time she wore the dress. Catherine's look will be showcased fully on December the 24th when Royal Carols Together at Christmas is broadcast on RTV. Unsurprisingly, Catherine fans were delighted by the princess's latest fashion move and particularly supported her decision to rewear a previous outfit. The service held at Westminster Abbey will celebrate the importance of togetherness as well as people who have gone above and beyond to support their communities up and down the country. Moreover this year's service will also include a tribute to late Elizabeth II who died at Balmoral Castle in September. The Princess of Wales who first launched Together at Christmas in 2021 will lead this initiative supported by Catherine and William's Royal Foundation in a major show of support immunity. King Charles and Queen Camilla will head to the Abbey in central London to attend the event in person alongside other members of the firm delighted royal fans by sharing a behind-the-scenes snap ahead of a much-anticipated Christmas carol service in the photograph shared by the Prince and Princess of Wales official Twitter account Kensington Royal Prince William's wife smiles while looking straight into the camera. Catherine is to take centre stage on Thursday evening, she will spearhead the second Together at Christmas special. A few hours prior Netflix will have released the second half of Harry and Meghan Markle series, including a first account by the Prince and Princess of Sussex about their life and struggles as working royals last year, Sophie, Countess of Wessex Zara and Mike Tyndall and Princess Beatrice were among the family members who had stepped out to be at the service. Prince William will also be in attendance and will be among the guests delivering a reading the carol concert, which promises to mix modernity and tradition will include a number of listers such as actor Hugh Bonneville and singer Mel. See the service will be televised by ITV on Christmas Eve with the title Royal Carols. Together at Christmas, the broadcast will add extra footage including a tribute to the late sovereign last year, it TV included in its program at Lip with Catherine playing the piano to accompany singer Tom Walker which took royal fans by storm. Singer